So this is a commentary I didn't really want to have to make. Well, when I came up with the idea of Spooptober about mid-July or so, I was kind of expecting by this point we would have a slightly bigger audience with slightly more audience retention, and slightly bigger percentage counts on our views. Um, I figured I could do anything. I think is the uh, gist of what I'm trying to get at. So when I came up with Spooktober, I was of the opinion that I could just do whatever, put it up on the channel, and be like, hey, look, the audience likes this. Isn't this nice? Uh, that is clearly not the case. Spooktober videos are only averaging about five views right now, and to be honest, I people have told me this before, and I brought it up in videos. While I have been told to do what I feel is... Uh, best for the channel and what to do what what I feel is fun for me and what I feel I get the most out of and, and not worry about view count when I'm having to put myself through horror games uh, because it's not for me it's for the channel because I thought it'd be fun uh, and I'm not seeing any returns on those videos pretty much none not even 10% it makes me think that people don't care and as a result of that, I'm prone less and less to care. And because I'm already kind of sacrificing a little bit of my health to play these games, uh, in the sense that I'm causing myself undue stress where it is not needed because I'm playing horror games and I don't usually play horror games, um, it seems uh, not worth it, <laughs> to put it in really simple parlance and to try and make it really concise. So, I'm of the opinion right now that I need to end Spooktober and just go back to the normal schedule and maybe plan out a Halloween special for the 31st. Maybe like a candy unwrapping or something. Something fun. But uh, right now, it just seems like not enough people care to warrant it. And again, I would not normally consider that a, a terrible thing because I continued with Hardcore Everything and I'm probably going to pick it back up now. Uh, despite, you know, fairly low view count. But it's over actually 10% of our, you know, subscriber base, so that's good. Um... But I'm seeing bigger audience retention and bigger returns on commentaries and countdowns and hardcore everything than I have pretty much anything else in the recent scope of things. So with that in mind, um, like I said, I think I'm going to shut down Spooptober unless I receive comment on this video saying otherwise. It's unlikely that I will, and Hayden and Niles, if you say no, I'm not counting your vote. I need to hear from the actual subscribers. So, if you think I should continue Spooktober, mention it. If not, and you'd like to go back to the normal scheduled programming, mention it. And if you don't say anything, I'm just going to count your vote as to go back to the normal scheduled programming. If that's the case, I will go back to that. I will go back to countdowns, commentaries, hardcore everything, and maybe the occasional humor piece here and there. Uh, but accepting that, it's, you know, gonna be back to business as usual. But I, and I'm disappointed by this because I was kind of hoping Spooktober would be bigger. I was hoping it would actually be a big subscriber draw because it would be very fun. Uh, I keep saying fun. I was hoping that, it, you know, the audience would get a lot out of it. They'd enjoy it. Uh, people don't seem to be. Uh, and that's unfortunate. I don't know if my reactions aren't big enough. I don't know what it is. But it's just not getting anything. And, uh, you know. That's sad, but it's the true it's the truth of things. And the videos are on the channel to entertain you. They're not here for me, and I'm already not enjoying the experience as it is. I thought about that today, and it's gonna bleed me dry if I keep having to buy games for no reason because I'm at, at this rate, I have to keep buying all of the games I need because I don't own them, and that's like another nine or so games. That would be like probably ninety dollars at least. Uh, and I don't want to throw that at this. So, I guess it's done. Sorry guys, I have another one planned for uh, February, hopefully that goes over a little bit better, but till then, I guess we're back to scheduled programming. See you guys later, unless you say otherwise.